What's up YouTube? This your boy the Hood Tech bringing guys another video. Today's video um is a continuation of the how to how to color your uh firearm slide, pistol slide, whatever you want to call it. Uh, you saw me coloring in the letters and the logos on my MMP 9C um red and I said I was going to do the back strap. This is the back strap back strap of the MMP 9C. What we got? We got here we got some plasti dip. And um, for you, go, for those of you who don't know what plastic dip is, go research it. Thousands of videos, hundreds of thousands of videos on YouTube about this. Okay, pretty much, it's uh, you you can say it's spray paint, but it turns plastic rubbery. Okay, so if you don't like something, you put enough coats on it, thick it, and you can just peel it right off. Okay, you don't have to worry about anything being too permanent anything like that but it is durable like i said in my other video i put this on my uh car's bumper and it hasn't been any chips or brakes so what we're gonna do go ahead and spray it like i said i got i don't have any newspaper so i took this old shirt i'm not using old shirt don't wear it should go in the garbage anyway but we're gonna use it for that shake up the can good And your first coat should be a just a light mist coat, so you don't have to worry about okay, just a light little mist coat. And that's what you want to do. So let it dry and come back. Okay, we let it sit and dry for uh, a couple minutes. We're going to do the second coat. You can go a little bit heavier. Okay, so we're gonna let it dry again. Come back. Um, keep coming back and forth. It's gonna take about three to four coats, so I'll just come back um, when it's finished. So right now we're just finished the third coat. Okay, it's looking uh, better and better. Um, Uh, you guys can see it's, it's coming along. All right, so we're gonna let that dry and keep going now. Hopefully, eventually, I'll show you the finished product. All right, so <clears throat> here we go. Uh, gun is clear. All right, here it is finished product okay probably can do one more coat but it came out all right um before you start like handling it i would give it a full 24 hours to um set and cure but um just for the purpose of this video i'm going to go ahead and put it on for now take it back off and if anything happens i just Spray over it and um, all right, so put that back in. All right, so that's how it will look. Okay. okay. So this is how it would look on your M and P nine C. That looks real cool to me. Um, to make it, I probably it probably look better if I do this, and maybe the mag release. 
but this is you can take this off so it'd be easy to you know it'd be easy to paint but this you have to mask off and tape off things and I don't know I just might just leave it like this but anyway as you guys can see this is my barrel colored okay we have the Smith and Weston Smith and Weston Springfield Massachusetts USA color field okay then we have the M and P 9C color field also Smith and Weston logo okay so there you have it I don't know about you guys but it looks it looks real good to me all right it's not too flashy but it does um show my personality my first favorite colors and i will know exactly what gun is mine if we're you know what i'm saying i like out with a lot of people at the range and we certain people have the same gun you know exactly which one is yours all right so if you guys like this video please give a thumbs up subscribe you're not always a already in a subscriber if you are a subscriber appreciate the love and support thank you guys for watching uh, any comments leave them down below this your boy the hood tech sign out with another video peace